The bad weather. In the winter, the weather is very bad, and today it is very cold and it is snowing. Anna feels very cold, but she has to go out to get bread for her family, and the market is very far from her home. She opened the door, and the wind was very strong. She got into the carriage and the horse took off. The road was very long, and Anna began to feel tired, and the horse saw nothing of the wind. Suddenly the cart stopped in the middle of the road. Then, Anna got out of the carriage, to see what happened, and she saw that the carriage wheel, was broken. She was very worried, because she didn't know, what to do. She tried a lot to fix the carriage wheel, but she cannot do it. The wind was very strong, and everything was blurred, and there was no one passing from the road, and Anna was feeling desperate. There was a voice coming from far away, and suddenly, a young man appeared. He was tall, black-eyed and had a luxurious chariot. Please, can you help me? Anna said, in a loud voice. The wind was very strong, and the man didn't know what was going on. What's going on here? said the young man. The wheel of the carriage was broken by the wind. Can you help me? Anna said. I want to go to the market, to get bread to my family. The young man was very kind, and he saw that Anna was very tired and really needed help, and he agreed to help her. Of course, I can help you. The wind is too strong. We cannot fix the carriage. I can get you on my carriage, said the young man. Anna agreed and got into his carriage. On their way, Anna asked him his name. What is your name? she said. My name is Tony. I'm a lawyer, and I come to town every year to get some work done. How about you? My name is Anna. I take care of my family and have to come to town to bring bread for my family. Anna was a little worried because she did not know him but she felt, he is a good person, and he was silent, the whole way. Finally, Anna and Tony arrived at the market, and it started raining again, the carriage stopped and Anna got off. Anna, thanked Tony so much, I did not know what would happen, if you did not come, in time, thank, you very much, she said. Really, there is no need for thanks. I always love helping others. It was a pleasure to meet you, and I wish you all the best. Goodbye, Tony said. Goodbye, Anna said. She was very happy, and at the same time, feeling a little upset, she wishes to meet him again. The End of Story